welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome to my channel my name is cynthia and and i am 22 years old and i am a mom to two dollars so if you're new hi i hope you stay and let's get on with today's video so far i started off in a really good mood i did my makeup um Lil's still in bed it is 8 17 and he's still in bed so I am actually about to um, log in really fast an order that I got yesterday. It has been my biggest order yet. If you guys don't know, I do have a business that I started a couple months back. Um, I make custom shirts and t-shirts and well, not just customs. Like I actually make them and just I prefer to make customs over regular designs. But anyways, that's besides the point. Um, yeah, so I started a business and I've actually gotten a lot of support on it. So I just want to say thank you so much. I feel like I've mentioned it here and there, but I never really talked about it. And yeah, so yesterday I actually got my biggest order yet. Um, I am very, very excited. I'm very thankful. I'm actually going to give this girl a shout out. So shout out to you, mom. 101 if you're watching because you are amazing you have always supported me i really do appreciate it and i'm about to log that in okay and that was that a few moments later it's 929 and so far I've cleaned upstairs I cleaned downstairs all I have left to do is do the dishes um, from this morning's breakfast but we're ready to go we're all dressed this is one of my curtain um, t-shirts that I have made what well, baby yeah we're gonna go Can you give mommy a kiss I have pretty much everything all ready to go all I have to do is just get them in the car we are right outside of Target slash Dollar Tree because they're like right next to each other where I am and we're gonna stop here and get some much needed essentials um i'm gonna tell you right now what we need and then i'm gonna show you what i got because it never goes the way i want it to go i always add extra things and i'm sure it's a thing that happens to people that can't control themselves like me anyways at target we're looking for easter backyard decorations a little basket to put forks in and um plastic eggs we need candy and we need toys and we need real eggs and then at dollar tree we need um green forks orange napkins and a backdrop if we see one um so i'm gonna go to target first literally it's like right there wow truck nice anyways it's right there and then dollar tree is literally like right there and we just need that stuff for tomorrow and then um, you guys are gonna see that in the next video you ready I okay. yeah it's a cool car let's go So they just have these for every season, don't they? Oh, no. So we just got back to the car from Dollar Tree. So we went to Target and Dollar Tree. Anyways, we're gonna go to another one because this one, yeah, it was the most convenient one. It was the closest one, but to be honest with you, it wasn't worth it. It sucked. I did find a couple things I needed, but not what was on my list. Eventually. Got. and we are out of there that was chaotic i literally couldn't even pull out my camera because it was just chaotic really fast i want to show you guys what i got so first things first eggs and these were three dollars and they bring 48 eggs which is pretty good for three dollars this is the other one and then oliver got this little hat so that's all we got from Target, which is good. We stayed on a budget. Next thing was Dollar Tree. The first one I went to, I saw that they had these for the eggs. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put eggs in here. I also got a bunch of um, bunny ears. So yeah, I got one for each of the kids. Oh, I also got a couple things to put in their Easter basket, like this little guitar thing. Leo got it, but I was actually very curious to see how it would sound, so I got it. Also, another one because we gotta get one of each for everybody because now there's a fight. If you know, you know. I got this for the pictures um, to put it like in the background or something because we want to take really nice pictures of the kids. It is currently two o'clock in the afternoon and I made lunch for everybody. 
we all ate and now it's time for their well it's been time for their nap but i tried to lay them down i even put on mickey for them it's up there and nothing I mean, they won't take a nap and i don't know if your kids are this way but if they don't nap they get so mean and cranky and just like overtired and it just oh my god it's making me so freaking mad because i'm just like i'm giving you a fluffy bed i'm giving you like a nice cool room i'm giving you everything you need everything that you always get when you go to sleep when you take a nap i even gave them a bath and they just they won't go down for a nap and i am feeling very overwhelmed so like what else am i supposed to do like i don't know what else to do um oh my god i don't show the bad bad parts of my days because i don't want to bore anybody but like i just feel like i can't breathe okay like i can't like just ah like i need them to go to sleep because they're just crying for no reason and they're just they're playing downstairs right now but like they're just mm, they pick a fight for any little thing and i don't know if i should take them to the park or not because like honestly like i don't want them to pick a fight with another kid and i know that's just bound to happen when they get like this a few moments later okay i'm going to the park oh my god so i just got something very important very important very like i was like desperate for this like i'm so glad i got it right now when i got it because i've been waiting for this i've been waiting for this for a really long time if you guys um i don't know who has like government help but we have um insurance from the government like the government gives us insurance like we have help in that department and so we have been waiting on these for forever these are their insurance cards um we recently had to change their pediatrician 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 their doctors because the lady was just very sus i don't want to say too much because there are people that do watch my videos that live here in my area and also that go to that same person so i don't want to say too much because obviously i don't want nobody snitching on me or anything but i heard and saw from multiple moms that go there um on a facebook post you guys facebook and me like we have a lot of stories but anyways i heard from a couple people couple not even just one like several people say a lot of bad things about the one we currently had right before we switched so like the one i moved away from so they were saying a lot of bad things about that lady and also that she supposedly she gave a vaccine that she wasn't supposed to to multiple children you know i don't know if it's true it did not happen to my child so i don't actually know if it's true or not but i didn't want to risk it because my kids were due for a couple vaccines and i just uh -uh, i heard it from several people several moms and i was just like uh, mm -mm, nope so we were just not good for each other it just wasn't a right fit at the end of the day there was a lot more things than just that one rumor that we heard it wasn't just one rumor but you get my point anyways um yeah so we are out of that um doctors and we are currently enrolled with another doctor that we like a lot better to be honest with you these are the cars that we were waiting on which oh my god i'm so relieved because like the kids as you heard oliver like he has like a little bit of a cough nothing huge it's just because of the weather change but still like it, it's always good to have it if you know you know and and it's something that i've been really worried about because it's good to always have a doctor whoa go well go pass me the ball no no
somehow talk to them and play a game with them so they don't fall asleep on me because if they fall asleep it's game over and we won't be able to have some alone time tonight meaning me and my boyfriend we like to watch tv together we're actually watching the show called ozarks 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 i don't know if i'm saying it right but that's what we're watching and i also have to do the order tonight so yeah there's just a lot um, oh, and I thought of the word that I was talking about earlier. It's called allegedly. Allegedly, that doctor gave the wrong vaccines to the babies. But anyways, I don't know how I randomly just thought of that, but I did, so I'm glad. <laughs> the wheels on the bus goes round, round, round. Round, round, round. round. The wheels on the bus goes round, round, round. All the way through town. One eternity later. So the kids are now sleeping. Thank God. Because it has been a heck of a day. Now it's my time to shine. Sorry I'm whispering. It's because they're sleeping. But anyways, I am about to fill the eggs, the Easter eggs with candy. This is all the materials that we have. I feel like I always buy all the cool eggs. This is enough eggs for five kids. <laughs> a lot of eggs. So um, this is what I came up with. I was trying to go for like a carrot looking little bags, but whatever. This is what we got, whatever. The eggs are down there. These are done. I don't know. It's getting late, honestly, and I am so tired. I hope you guys have a good day. Can't wait for you guys to see what we're gonna do next vlog because it's gonna be so exciting. Like, you guys are gonna see everything, like me setting up and everything. Anyways, that's all for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Love you. Bye.